हेलो एवरी वन एंड वेलकम टू एडू सर्च क्लिनिक्स आई एम डॉक्टर गुंजन देसाई एंड टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट अ सीरीज ऑन डिस्क्राइबिंग द वेरियस इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स दिस इज इम्पॉर्टेंट फॉर क्लिनिकल प्रैक्टिस एज वेल एज फॉर प्रैक्टिकल एग्जाम्स सो अ लॉट ऑफ इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स आर आस्ट इन द प्रैक्टिकल एग्जाम सो वी विल सी वेरियस इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स वन बाय वन ओके इन टू डेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी द इंटेस्टिनल स्टेपलर्स how they are used the mechanism of action of the staplers and various staplers that are available so you can see some of the stapler i'm sure you have seen these in your ots as well okay this is the gis stapler of covidian right if you have not seen it before these are used in open surgery okay we will also see laparoscopic staplers in upcoming videos these staplers are used for intestinal anastomosis okay side to side or end to side whichever anastomosis you want to do for small bowel large intestine small intestine to stomach as well as colon okay the low rectal and inner anastomosis are done by circular stapler that we will see in the other parts of this video series okay so this is a classical gia stapler okay it has two parts okay this part where there is a preloaded area okay this is the anvil it is the fixed part of the stapler and this is the other part of the stapler which will lo load the cartridge okay this is the locking mechanism of this stapler okay here you can see it is locked you have a knob at the back by which you can open the stapler okay now this is how the cartridges are available this is a green cartridge the color of the cartridge varies as per the company also as per the thickness of the tissue okay so green cartridge usually is used for stomach thick tissues okay white is vascular always remember some basic colors white is for vascular they are used for thin tissues okay uh blue is intestinal stapler blue is for bowel b for b so blue is for intestine green is used for stomach and black we use for pancreas okay the thickest of the tissues black is used for pancreatic transaction okay so now we will just see these are pre study like this is an open cartridge just to show in this video what you do is once you have open the cartridge you fix the nozzle first okay this is how okay there is a locking mechanism in this nozzle so what you do is you fix this nozzle first you have to keep this open okay until and unless you are fixing the stapler to the bowel this has to be kept open what you do is you fix this here right you have fix this then you press this okay once you press the stapler here it is fixed okay so this is how you fix the stapler okay this is 60 mm cartridge this is 60 mm cartridge you can see marking up to 6 okay so 1 cm is one mark and if you see the number of rows there are four rows so this is known as two layered stapling if there are six rows it is three layered stapling that is how this is done this middle line is for the cutter okay this is the line for the cutter so two rows on each side of the anastomosis and this is the line where it will cut okay as i said this is 1 cm distance marking the similar stapler but if you can see okay the size of the staple is bigger the cartridge is bigger in size this is 10 cm you can see the marking okay we call it 100 okay this is 60 this is 100 so let us see the loading again what you do is you fix the nozzle first right then you press the stapler so and then you press this area once you press this the cartridge is loaded i have already said keep this open right then you take the anvil end okay and you have to fix it in a way that it locks okay if you can see there is a black knob right in this anvil end of the stapler you have to put that knob in the crease that is provided here for the knob okay similarly at the back end you have a knob in the anvil and a groove in the stapling side so you can fix these two right 
this is how it is fixed once you have fixed it properly okay you will see that this can be locked okay so now this stapler is locked okay so this is how you load a stapler right the parts of the stapler we have already seen when you want to open this is how you open now classical teaching is your two fingers are used to grasp the stapler okay what we do is we open this slightly then suppose this is the tissue what you do is you slide the tissue here okay and then you lock the stapler so this is how it is locked okay and this is the standard grip of the stapler if you want to open this is 100 is difficult to open by single hand but this is how you can open this black button helps in opening the stapler okay and this is how you lock it once you have locked this stapler you wait for around 15 to 20 seconds we wait for 30 seconds okay why we wait because the stapler provides compression of the tissue okay and the staple height is decided as per the compressed tissue okay so if you don't wait there is a high chance that the tissue edema or the thickness of the tissue may not be traversed by the stapler okay so that is why you always wait for 20 to 30 seconds after applying pressure once you have applied this what you do is this is the firing knob the good thing about this is you can use it with the right as well as the left hand okay that is the benefit of this knob so like i said two fingers to hold the stapler so that it does not move okay it should not move like this when you are firing what you do is you stabilize the stapler with one hand and with this hand you fire okay you fire this okay and then you bring this back that is what staples the tissue and then cuts with the knife that is inbuilt in this stapler okay each cartridge has a knife but the knife pusher is inbuilt in the stapler okay so what you do is fire and then bring it back right this is what you do okay once you have done that open the stapler okay and you will see the tissue is cut open right so this is how you use a GIA stapler this is 100 centimeter this is 60 centimeter you can see here the knife okay this is the blade in the cartridge right similarly this cartridge has a blade right so this you can see is the blade okay that is how you use a GIA stapler okay this is how you lock it then lock it okay and then fire it right so as I have already said the cartridges are of various colors you get green cartridge which is for stomach thicker tissues the width of the staples is more okay so that you can cover thicker tissues you select green for stomach blue is for bowel white is for vascular black we use for pancreatic transaction okay you get universal staplers now but that is more commonly seen in laparoscopic staplers which we will see in another part of this video thank you